Now to our big story at 6.30 on UTV 44. The holiday season is far from over. We've got just one more to go. Of course, it's all about counting down, and especially when you're talking about this year's New Year's Eve events in the Port City. Only four days left until the new year begins, and if it's anything like last year, it's expected to be quite the party. Local 15's Taryn Reed was downtown with an all-access pass to all the action. I most certainly did have an all-access backstage pass to the Moon Pie Overmobile events, and I learned something new. There are actually two Moon Pies, one that sits atop the Trustmark building nearly all year round. The other one is lit up and sent off for New Year's Eve. <laughs> From fireworks to a dancing moon pie, you'll probably see it all come New Year's Eve 2014. And don't forget about the bands. But with a huge celebration like what's expected in just a few days, the prep work is an overload. You'll start seeing things really take shape tomorrow. The uh, stage begins to be set up for our uh, headliner Gretchen Wilson in the opening act, Lattimore, and that'll be um, right down the street here on St. Francis Street. And and check this out, it's the actual moon pie that will drop some 28 stories December 31st, close to midnight. You may wonder why it's not in the sky at the top of the building. That's because there's two. This one sits here nearly year-round, while this one is meant just for New Year's Eve. It's packed tight with batteries and cables, wires, and it fits inside the moon pie on the side of the building. Come New Year's Eve... <laughs> The one inside lights up and drops. The whole trip down takes a little over a minute. There's an edible version of this moon pie. It's a giant one, too. A bakery in Chattanooga just shipped it this way, and if you wondered what it tastes like... Um, so anybody who's around, come and get a bite of the giant edible moon pie. Family fun. That's the goal for this year's celebration, and the city will be in full-on work mode until 11.59 on December 31st. There are tons of events planned for this year's New Year's Eve celebration. They all kick off around 5 p.m. on New Year's Day. And if you're wondering, museums down here are also offering free admission. Just call ahead, check before you head out. All of this information is on our website. Check out the Find It section on local15tv.com.